Hey guys, today I'm going to the video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you how to fix your Notes app if it's not working on your iPhone or iPad, whether it's just simply crashing or not syncing, or you can't simply open the app or having issues. All of these troubleshooting steps that we're going to show you is going to fix any issues that you might be having. So let's get started. So whenever you're having issues with the Notes app, the very first thing you want to do is pull down the top control center from your iPhone and then simply turn on airplane mode for a moment and turn it back off. So what that does is a quick network refresh because if you're having any connectivity issues, especially with your Wi-Fi or cellular data, it should resolve those issues. Now, after you have done that, next thing you wanna check is the Apple system service page. So if you go into your browser on your phone, simply go to Apple system status. So if you Google that, it will take you to Apple system status. And the reason why you wanna check this, this page is that Apple provides a lot of iCloud services and sometimes if it's not working, for example, we'll look for the notes app. So if you see your iCloud notes right here, if your iCloud is in syncing with the notes that you have across your devices, you want to ensure that this is available. In rare cases, there might be times where it's not available or unavailable or there's an issue. Apple will report that and in order to uh, resolve that is that you have to wait. Apple generally fixes that within a few minutes, a few hours, but generally they'll fix that issue. But it's a quick thing to check in case there is any outages going on with that iCloud node itself. Now, after you have done that, the next thing you can do in terms of trying to fix your uh, notes app is simply closing and reopening the app. Now, it sounds really simple, but it's effective. So all you want to do is swipe up and then close it completely. And I recommend probably closing out all the other apps as well. And then go ahead and reopen it, then relaunches your notes so if there was any Issues with the app will be resolved. Now, after you have done that and it's not working, now it's time to do a forced restart on your iPhone or iPad. So it's gonna be really simple. All you'll do is volume up, volume down, one after another, and then hold the side button just like that. Again, remember, it's gonna be volume up, followed by volume down, one after another. Make sure that's quick, and then you wanna keep on holding that side button. Although it says slide to power off, we're gonna keep on holding that side button again until we see the Apple logo and then I let go of that button. And what we have done is simply shut down the phone altogether and then the code is reloading again. So if there was any issues with the code or the software of your iPhone, it will be resolved. Now this method will not delete any of your personal data. So all of your photos, apps, and data that you have will be there on your iPhone. Now after you have done that, the next thing you wanna do if you're still having issues, it is go into your settings and you want to check your account that the device that you're looking to sync your note in has the same account signed in. And then once you do that, click on the device um, name Apple ID. And then what you will want to do is under your iCloud services, you want to look for show all. And then you'll want to look to make sure that your sync is on for your notes. So let's say well, the other thing you can do is turn it off briefly where you want to turn it off. It will say delete and then you want to turn it back on. And that does a quick refresh as well and reloads your iCloud notes if you have notes across your devices. Now, after you have done that and you're still having the issue, the next thing you want to see if there's an update out for the app itself. In order to check that, you're going to go to your app store. You're going to go to search pager and then search for notes. Now, the notes is a default app on your iPhone. Rarely they don't have much update, but in a case that they do, you want to see if there's an update, it'll say update, click on the update option. Just like, let me give you an example of an app, app that needs update, we'll have that update button. And all you'll do is make sure you're connected to the internet with cellular Wi-Fi data and then click on that update itself. Now, after you have done that, the next thing you want to do in order to troubleshoot is check the storage on your iPhone. So you want to go into your settings and this time under settings, we're going to go all the way in the beginning of settings to general and then where it says iPhone storage and you want to ensure that your iPhone have enough storage in order to sync or be able to store your notes. As you can see, I have 21 gig that I have used out of 128 gig on this phone, but let's say your phone has used up all the gigs. What you want to do is start deleting some apps, maybe some videos and photos to clear up some space in order for the notes app to work properly. It will need storage in order to save and sync your notes on the notes app now after you have done that and you're still having issues the next thing you want to do in order to troubleshoot is simply click on your apple id and i recommend going ahead and signing out and then signing back in now it sounds really simple but what happens is when you do that 
it again allows the phone to sync any sort of data that you have between your device and also ensure again that it's the same app wide you're using across your device if you're looking for syncing to work correctly now after you have done that and you're still having the issue the next thing you want to do is go in your settings general and then all the way down here where it says transfer reset iphone you want to do a reset the very first on and where it says reset all settings but before you do that understand what this does this will reset things like your network settings your keyboard dictionary setting home screen layouts settings and location and privacy setting everything setting related no data itself so if you have custom settings for any of these settings it will simply get reset in order to troubleshoot any software related issue and generally if you do that it's going to take about a minute or two and it's really quick and easy again will not delete any of your personal data now lastly if you're still having issues the next thing you can do is actually delete and reinstall the notes app so it's really simple in order to delete it you press and hold and then remove app delete app and then click on delete now it will be deleted and then all you'll do next time is go ahead to your app store again search for notes again which will show up again and you will click on notes here when it shows up make sure it's from apple the correct one and then you'll click on that cloud with the pointing arrow downward so that the download process happens again to download should take about a minute or two even shorter than that depending on your wi-fi connection and then you'll want to notice at the very end on the app library, you'll see your notes here, you'll press and hold, so you can add it to home screen so it's easily accessible and then move it around to the desired location it was maybe previously, put it here, and then go ahead and open it up and it'll say welcome to notes. And then you wanna ensure that iCloud settings is turned on, you go to settings here, and then iCloud under show all again, and this time as you can see notes is turned off, turn it back on, and then it should sync up your notes again after you load it up give it a moment or so you can simply close it out and reopen as well as you'll see here it's spinning here give it some time and as you can see here my previous note on the iCloud has been loaded back onto the phone and I can see the local notes as well now lastly if none of these troubleshooting help you can simply go ahead and try to update your phone you want to go into your settings general software update now if there is update available It'll say download and install and make sure that you have enough storage again to download and you're connected to Wi-Fi or cellular data and you'll want to go ahead and install the latest update because a previous update might have caused the phone to not function correctly or maybe there's a bug with the notes app generally again like I said make sure your phone is at least 50 percent or more whenever you're doing update and give yourself about half an hour to 45 minutes for the update to successfully happen and that's it for all the troubleshooting steps in order to help you fix your notes app on your iphone or ipad i hope this video was helpful if so please make sure that like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time